Now the next is meter and thermometer. Now in the meter display you can find meter tag here, meter element here and when you drag it it will show you some visual interface like that and of course you can do its sizing. Now this is having a meter ranging from 0 to 100 and I'll just tag it with the same address n7 colon 0 for the demonstration so I'll tag it here. So this is having 56 because this n7 column 0 is 56. So this is another visual interface if you want to show let's say the feedback from the motor from the drive or if you want to show the voltage 0 to 10 volt or your AC voltage 220 volts and if you are having those values in your PLC you can reflect that in your SCADA screen by just tagging with the required data register. Now this is getting varied 237 because I'm changing it using a potentiometer. So this is reflected here. Zero. And you can go up to maximum. That is 98. And of course, when you whenever you see something analog scaling here, you will also find its maximum and minimum value and the desired value. You will already you will always find it here. The tick size is 10, which means its difference is from 10. I can make it 5 to have more precise variations like that. Okay, so it's up to you how you want the tick size, how you want the color, and the maximum limit and the minimum limit you can select from your property section. So this was your meter indicator. Similarly, you have a thermometer which looks like that. Now in thermometer, you again have a range from 0 to 100, and this is generally used when you are measuring the, measuring the temperature in your process right now right now I don't have a thermometer or a temperature measurement device in my PLC so I'm going to use the same uh, potentiometer because here you have you have to learn how to read the value from the PLC okay in case if you are having the value from coming from the uh, coming from the temperature sensor you can directly link that with that tag so in here I'll just do the simulation from this potentiometer 78 degree because this is 78 the tag is 78 so if I move this will show you variations like that so this shows actually the high temperature this is the optimum temperature and if it is below this level it is the you know low temperature and you can select this tag select this stick here which is currently if you select this one yeah here are the properties it's value it's higher bound and slower bound and this is the scale which is already there I hope we cannot change that but here you have the the you can see the unit this is now in Fahrenheit this is in Celsius and that's in Kelvin for that you can have it here okay so in Celsius are having the value 6 degree this is 0 1 because it is mercury so it is increasing and showing you like a mercury okay so this was how to display values in thermometer and normal meter okay this is more like working on the HMI part this is the HMI part we are doing in the SCADA okay in the next video we'll see the numeric input which is again an interesting topic in SCADA screen thank you